Okay, hey guys, Anime West Reacts here is going to be a reaction to Sword Art Online Alicization, episode 41 overall of War of Underworld, I think it's like 5 or 6, 4 or 5, somewhere in there, 4 or 5 or 6, I don't know. But yeah, hope y'all enjoy the reaction, if you do, then make sure to leave a like, comment on the video, subscribe for more anime reaction reviews and manga reviews, and yeah, check out links down below to my Twitter, Twitch, and Discord, and let's get into this in 3, 2, one and play. Okay. Connections. Huh. Cool. <laughs> it's actually pretty cool that they're incorporating the whole ordinal scale movie into this. But yeah, so last episode things started going really, really badly. Or they were going really bad and now they're just kinda getting worse. So we have seen on fighting Vecta after he almost kinda ate her soul. But thanks to the node thing from Kirito's that he had on his chest during the Death Gun incident, which they didn't really explain that. Explained it in the novels, but not in the anime. Why she had that, but yeah, so that ends up saving her. And she's able to kind of regain her cool, make her bow into her Hikate, and then fires that at Vecta and shoots him through the hand, which he just pretty much just like heals immediately and then makes his own sniper. Then we had Leafa showing up with. Iskon and Shato were in saving them. <clears throat> but yeah, everything else was pretty bad given that we have pretty much all the Chinese and Korean players kind of turning against Asuna and the underworld people, but pretty much outside of Moon Phase and May. Because, yeah, and then Pooh revealed himself. And now we got this thing with Kirito. Let's move. <laughs> well, I'm sorry I shouldn't laugh at that, but yeah, it's just like, just move. Yeah. Blackie. set everything up in a way. I said a wear up. That's not how this works. Well. Hmm. <laughs> it said good morning though. Look how he keeps his hand on Yu-Gi-Oh's sword the entire time. Hmm. This will not let go of that sword. At least oh. Yeah. It's the one thing. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Pretty messed up, yeah. <laughs> Dear touch him. Uh, but, yeah. situation here. Okay. <laughs> and yeah. <laughs> hmm. The hell are you? <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. AG. <laughs> so cool that they included this. Or included him in Obviously, the novels don't go like this. I don't know if obviously is the correct word, but yeah. Hmm. Pretty cool, though, that 
Let's see this. <laughs> AG. Damn. Cowardly hackers. Oh, you got the visual, though. Okay. Hmm. Hey. <laughs> Fix the Yuna. Hmm. Alright. And Yuna. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Yep. For real. It's really her. <laughs> Alright. Oh, glad they bought this song back. Or they included it. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty awesome. Oh, I really enjoy it. <clears throat> Makes me think of two of the beginning. Always when I hear that first part. AG vs. Visago, though. That is not what I would have expected. Not that I'm complaining or anything, but... Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Making them regain their senses. It really is you now. Mm hmm. Pretty awesome. <laughs> they showed her in the first opening, but they never, like, included her, so it's kind of, like, odd. This is pretty awesome, though. Hmm. Who are you? <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Knights of the Blood Oats. Nautilus. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's pretty awesome. Going back to his Blood Oats uniform. Black to white. Hmm. So yeah, we've seen Kirito do this whole thing where like his uniform changes. <clears throat> Whether they explained why that happened, I don't know, but yeah. It's all about incarnates. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Completely useless weakening back then, but now... Hmm. Yeah. The one person. Can't forgive. Yeah. Never forgive. <laughs> hmm. Damn. It is going ham, though. Flashback, I guess. <clears throat> Can only assume that's what that is, or that's what this is. Hmm. Okay. I don't think there's an OP. I have completely forgotten if the OP played. I think it did. Yeah. Hmm. Oh. Damn. Oh, with his arms. Sago's life. <clears throat> Devil spawn. Hmm. So yeah. Years. Don't like it's dead all of a sudden. Hmm. Unusual kidney failure. Hmm. 
Bell's voice actor, but I'm unsure. Hmm. So yeah. Pretty much threatened him to give up a kidney for his son that he actually cares about. <clears throat> hmm. so much, I guess. <laughs> hmm. Let's see, oh, instant. Three days. Let's see, yeah. Uh. Hmm. That tool. This is either before it, or I'm assuming it's before it. Black market. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, how oh, got in the game. <laughs> he stole the nerve gear. of hell. <laughs> so just poo. That's where the name comes from. Kill all the Japanese I want in this world. Hmm. Damn. Well, he put up a good fight. I don't say. Hmm. Still going for it. Damn. <laughs> Don't have arms, I'll use my teeth. Hmm. Well, man, she's Yuna now. Or, forget what you just. Yeah. <laughs> do what I needed to do. Hmm. Yeah. Real good job, actually. <laughs> but yeah, no. They both disappear. It was a cool little brief thing there, actually. Hmm. Yeah. Laughing coffin mark. Hmm. Yep. This <laughs> is a serious. Exactly what he is. But yeah, now that Yuna's gone, he can put his whole thing back on them. Evil grasp thing. Yeah. Hmm. Well, now they're gonna kill each other. messed up. Well, at least the Prince of Hell. Wake you up soon. Hmm. Everyone's gonna die if you keep lying there. Back to Sino. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It was still cool that they included them like that. Age and Yuna that way. Because <clears throat> honestly, I forget how they got out of that situation in the novel. But I know they weren't there at the very least. Seventh shot. Slow mo, though. Okay. Hmm. Does he? Boom. Ooh, there goes our other leg. That's the shot from the PV. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Got Leafa now. Hmm. Okay. 
It's an arm now. Yeah, they're all going through it pretty much. So yeah. I don't think they explained how her thing works, but yeah. Unlimited regen basically. She is essentially immortal. <clears throat> Yeah, Leafa's thing is, like, basically she's immortal, in a sense. Or she just, like, heals. <clears throat> like, Xenon can fly, Asuna can do the land, or the territory changing stuff, and then Leafa basically has, like, infinite health. Or essentially what is infinite health, like, just always regenerates. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty awesome. I mean, it's awesome in the fighting sense, but not in the pain tolerance sense. Because, yeah. Obviously, she feels the pain when she takes damage. Like that. Oof. So, yeah. <laughs> like, she feels that, and then she just regens her health. There's like a mental burden though in her case. Obviously. <laughs> yeah. Okay, see no one. Oh, once again. <laughs> Saved by the thing again. Not that that's bad, it's pretty awesome actually. Yeah. System features should still be intact. Hmm. <laughs> but yeah. I have to believe in myself. Hmm. Pretty awesome. <laughs> yeah, Solus bow. Solus's bow. Observe the resources from the surrounding. Hmm. Fire. <laughs> Yeah. Pretty awesome. Hmm. Moments in this episode. Blew his arm off, burned his face. Hmm. Many times as it takes. <laughs> Ooh. Obviously, Tiano's not his priority. Uh -huh. At least she survived. So yeah, Tiano's not his priority. She was kind of in his way. So he just needed to get her out of the way. Yeah, but a great fight, I'd say. She's just fighting all those guys. <laughs> yep. Good going, Rinko, and bye. So, yeah, he's dead. <laughs> Good going, Rinko. <laughs> it did startle me, but yeah. <laughs> Just a scratch. <laughs> so, yeah. All right. Hmm. Of course you can trust me. <laughs> and yeah. Hmm. All right. to dinner sometime. <laughs> Alright. Hmm. Cheap date, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that line had death flag written all over it. Alright. Connected to the S2. 
steals. Hmm. Right. I'm gonna wake up. Hmm. So yeah. Connecting everyone to Kirito. <laughs> okay, that they're in their colors. The glowy effect. Hmm. Hmm. Without Kirito. <laughs> was a dream. Hmm. So, yeah. Pretty great episode, I would say. Love how they incorporated Eiji and Yuna into this. Because, honestly, I don't remember how they got out of that situation. Like, in the novels, Yuna and Eiji didn't show up there. But, I don't remember how they got out of that. But, yeah. I think it plays out the same way, just that, or like similar to how the rest of the episode went after that. Just that Yuna and Ag didn't show up, but like I said, I love that incorporation because keeping everything kind of canon, like the movie, pretty much, or pretty much making the movie canon is what they've done. But yeah, so also that whole scene with Leafa's fight is pretty brutal there because she just has inf infinite regeneration basically of her health, so she can't, her account can't die. She just constantly takes the pain and has to keep pushing forward. Like, I saw at one point one of the guys threw a spear through her head, and then she just had to like pull it out and keep fighting. But yeah, so everyone kind of had their moment. Mainly A.G., Sinon, and Leafa, As well as Yuna, which is pretty cool. But overall, hope you all enjoyed the reaction. Next episode is titled Memories. So yeah, hope you all liked the reaction. If you did, then make sure to leave a like, comment down below, subscribe for more anime reaction reviews and manga reviews. Check the links down below to my Twitter, Twitch, and Discord. And yeah, I would really appreciate it if you guys would subscribe to the channel, and I will see you all next time. So yeah, later.